Hello guys, we got this Samsung A20s fried inside the microwave. We don't have cellular signal. Let's open the device and see what's happened inside this device. Also, we smell uh, the burning. Too much smell inside this phone. So you can heat the back with 2 Celsius degree for every 30 seconds. You have just to be careful with the fingerprint flex cable at the top because we don't have any flex cables anywhere. Now you can remove all the screws and then we will remove the SIM card tray. All right, let's explain what's happening. The customer cams told me that his nephew put some water onto the device and then he wanted to help. So he put the device into the microwave for about 10 seconds or five seconds. And then he told me we didn't have any signal in that 10 seconds so he brought the device to me to see if we can fix this device this is the first time i hear someone put the device into the microwave i loved it's a uh, good that nothing happens during putting it into the microwave We got here parent components and parent points, cellular antenna points. We have here two sides, one to the right and to the left. And we have a parent components to the right side. Also we have into the left. Let's check and see if we have something under the motherboard. Seems we don't have anything burnt at the back. Should be it's in the front. I don't know really if this will be fixable or not. We have some burnt components. I really don't have these components. We can get these points, but the components I can get it. I don't have any donor boards, so I gonna pass this repair. Because if we fix these and we got solve and get these components, we may end fixing another problem. We don't know if there is another problems caused with this device. So I'm going to assemble the device and let the customer know. Just to mention, we will never charge the customer any cents.
you can see here there is a plum component here also the traces of the cellular points could be broken so that's why it may cause a lot of money to fix this problem and get these components so for me the fixing is not worthy unless the customer want the phone to be repaired the phone is still functional so if he need the data he can get the data so he can buy a new phone it's up to him we have also parent components at the subboard so we may need to change the support also and fix the components from the main board and these could uh, cost about 100 USD so the fixing is not suitable for this case I'm gonna end the video if you have any questions you can just write in the comments below thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe we will do something else in the next video peace